Hello, everybody. Hi. What's up? Guess what? It's 118. <laughs> it released a couple of days ago, but I haven't gotten around to it yet. Um, I had to upgrade the world first. By that I mean prep it for upgrading. I actually haven't upgraded it yet. This is the first time I'm opening the game in 118, other than a quick test before I did the world preparation. Oh my god, the new music and everything is in the game. <laughs> oh, fuck. I'm like really giddy, actually. I've been hearing a lot of really great things about how the game is right now. A lot of people are super, super impressed. And like, are like rediscovering their childlike wonder and shit. And I truly can't wait to get into it. Uh, real quick. Yeah, yeah, we got our volume settings correct. Awesome, awesome. Um, so yeah. There is, okay, so last episode I was really drunk and I don't remember what I did. I think I enchanted things, actually. Oh, look at that mountain back there with the holes in it. You know I love mountain holes. Oh, wow. I'm sorry. I just... <laughs> um, what's that over there? Is that a village? Oh my god, it is. It is a village. That's so cute. I'm gonna be honest. I'm stalling for time because I like the music. That's not necessary. The music's in the game as well. It's not just menu music. Let's get into it. As you can see, last version I opened this up in is 117.1. I thought it was going to give me the prompt to make a backup. Um... <laughs> So, what we're doing right now is trusting Mojang with our everything. And this is an... We're, we're not undoing this one, folks. Now, the loading is taking quite a while. And I think that's because they have to, like, generate the new caves and shit underneath the chunks that we've already loaded. Cause like, it's not like it's generating the whole world at once or anything, like whether or not we discovered it, we are falling. I hope they never remove this glitch. I don't know if I hope that, but I don't know. I hope it sticks around for a little bit longer because it's a little, why do I have a diamond pickaxe? Okay, frames are going to be hella choppy on this first episode of 118. Sorry, folks. They don't like when I look that direction. Ah. Some classic music. Lena's going to be... She, she She's going to be sneaking up on us any minute. But for now, we got C418. Yeah. The... Technically, it's generating a lot underneath us right now, so, um, it's allowed to be framey. So, 
seven. Uh, how are you guys doing? I'm doing pretty good right now, actually. Playing a new Minecraft update. I don't know if you knew that. Is this my water bucket? I hope this isn't a holdover from the cheating episode extravaganza. Um, I really should have edited both of those videos before I started playing again, but I just couldn't resist. I couldn't stop myself, guys. I'm excited. I feel like a kid on Christmas. Maybe not Christmas. Maybe like Easter or something. I don't know if I'm Christmas level excited at this moment quite yet. Maybe I will be. Maybe we'll change that. Give me. Give me all that Give me all that shnya. I've discovered a flaw with our farm terrace idea. Um, just while I was looking back at footage editing and shit. I noticed there's a lot of me going back and forth between the animals and this barrel right here. And see, it's really counterintuitive to store, store all of the things I get from these farms anywhere other than this farm. To me, at least. But it turns out, I need the vast majority of these, like, products, by that I mean these three, to breed over there. The pigs are lonely. They need a child. Um, and the only way I can do that is by going, yomping down here, getting into water. Hello, fishies. And yeah, what are they all congregating for? What you cry for? I think that's the name of a song I know. Real quick. Yeah, yeah, it's called what you like the letter and then cry and then for like the number. What you cry for by Theo Parrish. It's a difficult one to find. It's like not on Spotify. It's on YouTube though. Look it up. Tell me what you think. It's a weird song. I found it from an even weirder horror game. It's not really a horror game, is it? It's just kind of a weird game. Anyway. Yeah, Theo Parrish, What You Cry For. Um, and it's morning. Check it out, check it out. Nothing up my sleeves, no commands. I slept, I promise. I don't know why I feel the need to prove that to you. What are you, the cops? Even if you were cops, I don't respect you. Anybody in the comments section a cop? If so, I don't respect you. I think you're evil. I live in America for context, but Anyone who doesn't live in America and thinks cops are good, well, you wait a decade or two to see how things end up in your country, huh? There's a problem if you give all, if you give one force total authority in law enforcement and give them a monopoly on violence. It's only okay if they do it. If someone does it to defend themselves against them, you're going to jail forever. And by that I mean they're shooting you in the head. Anyway, Minecraft, guys. How about that? We love this game. So, we're about to... Run out of... Potototo. Popepo. So, what today's episode is going to be... Um, and by that, I mean, I don't really know what to... Hi. Gotta say hi to the book. Gotta say hi to the book. Oh, that makes sense that I have a diamond pickaxe because I needed to mine the obsidian because I needed to make an enchanting table. 
protection, 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 protection. Efficiency, efficiency, sharpness, power, efficiency. I'm breaking. I am breaking. Weird that it wasn't showing me the first. Anyway, anyway. What are we fucking doing right now? Oh. Cool. Arn. 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 I had to make a book and everything. I was a busy little bee last episode. Busy little bumblebee. That's what I would be if I was a bee. Bumble. Cool. We should make a smoker. How do you make a smoker? I don't know. Anyway. We should bake trees. I don't think that's correct. So we're going to improve this little bridge area someday. But I do want to keep the jump hole because that's something that makes me very happy. Got the eggs on these motherfuckers. You should have seen it. The size of the eggs on that broad. Um, we're just gonna put this in there. Is what I think. Um, we're gonna keep the cow. I think the cows and the chickens are good, in terms of breeding. Maybe we waste this last two wheat. Not waste. Use. Maybe we use this last two wheat on the sheep. Hi. Bet y'all are horny. It's been a very long time. Don't look at me like that. You can't have one. Your only option is a child and two people on their refractory periods. You don't want this. I'll feed you when you're ready. I'll feed you when you're allowed to be horny. Horny police. Okay. What are, what are you like doing? Right. I was in the middle of saying that when I interrupted myself, like usual. So, I don't really have a super plan for this episode, but I do have something that I want to do. Two things. I want to see the edges of our world and see the new terrain generation, see if that blending actually works. Mostly I want to go to a jungle and see the jungle, check up on him, how she's doing. Genderless jungle, please be respectful. And I also want to check out the new caves down below. This might actually take two episodes. Both are, it's only two tasks, but they're very large tasks, which is what. Now, I was going to make a large genitalia joke, but I don't think I could justify anything where I have to refer to my cock and balls as large tasks. So I think I'm gonna abstain from this one. Look at the bloopy. Oh, the scrunkly. The bimpy. You know what he says, his famous catchphrase, I'm the bimp. Comment below if you're, it, com comment below, I'm the bimp. Um. Watch, that's gonna be like a horrific slur in like Australia or something. 
I'll tell ya. I'll tell ya, there's been a couple of... I'm sitting like a crazy person right now, I want you to know. That's how you know I'm... I was gonna say... I was gonna say <laughs> a bad word of my own there. YouTube doesn't like that word. That's how you know I'm a gay, is how I'm gonna rephrase it. Um... Yeah, I've had a couple of close encounters with British slurs. Um, and don't get me wrong, American slurs can sound just as silly. But, yeah, you gotta be careful and cautious when you're calling things scrongly boinkus. Because every now and then a Brit gets upset. <laughs> Every time you see a shooting star, a Brit gets upset. Every time you hear a bell ringing, a Brit gets upset. A Christmas Carol, my favorite movie. <laughs> uh, yeah. All right, so we're not going to be... We're not going to be doing the... Uh, Hello? What the fuck am I saying? We're not gonna- we might not be doing the whole perim- Axolotl or dolphin? The world may never know. Oh. It was a dolphin, I think. So we're gonna go towards the jungle, cause that's what I really wanna check up on. And as, as you've seen, it did not offer me to create a backup. I think it only does that in experimental snapshots and shit. So, um, oopsie. Um, it's okay. Um, like I said, I trust Mojang. They are releasing 118.1 within the week. But I looked at the, uh, sorry, I had to set my water down. I did look. I love to get free kelp. I looked at the patch notes for 118.1. I was like, should I wait until 118.1? And the bugs that they're fixing don't really seem to be relevant to my terrain gen experience. So I'm going to let it be. Oh, I still got my carrots on me. Ow. Jiminy Christmas. Ponko slut. Ponko slut. So, yeah. What are we doing here? Is we're gonna... Well, first of all, first of all, what are our video settings? 14 chunks. That's the way I like it. Jump in the cack. Got a gun. No girls. Girls gotta die. <laughs> my sense of humor is such shit. YouTube poops ruined me. And like my life. What is all this? What's this dilda of an outcropping? Did I really deal with that? Well, I've been flying everywhere for so long that I'm spoilt. The edge of the northern sea, its borders contain me now that I am boat bound. This hideous mountain over here, this is where the jungle starts. How can there be so many of you with the new light level changes? Well, I guess they're in a cave. More of you. I'll take one. We 
which one of you? You're unnecessary. It's interesting that they only show the flowering part. No way. I thought this was an azalea tree. I was like, what the fuck? I was like, I've generated this chunk before. How'd they put it here? Shame about azalea wood. God rest its soul. They haven't made any official statement on that, on whether they're going to add it. They did mention in the 119 announcement, they were like, with mangrove trees, they were like, and what's a new wood without a new wood type? Like, what's a new tree without a new wood type or something? cheeky like that and I was like I was like I don't know Mojang what is it <laughs> I think I Mojang is full of the nicest people on earth I also think that they take sadistic pleasure in their press releases um hence the mob vote and some other things that they've said and it's never in a malicious way I think I think it's in a playfully malicious way, maybe. Like, they really seem to love the fact that we hate phantoms. And you know what? I love it too. I think that's awesome. Is this mice on Venus? Sure is. Parkour! I meant for it. I could have eaten an apple. I should be saving these apples. What am I doing? Those are for gold. Alright, we're approaching the jungle. Prepare to lose frames. Unwatchable content. 10 out of 10. Da da bee bee. Da da bee bee. That's the, that's the kind of commentary you guys crawl back for. Hello? That was very upsetting for my computer, apparently. They said, what the fuck did you just say? You say da da bee bee? I'll kill you. That's what my computer said. That is a non-actionable threat. I am not threatening any of my viewers. I'm so paranoid about that shit. Being on Twitter has killed my, like, it's killed my sense, it's killed my, like, humorous delivery, because I can no longer include death threats in my sense of humor. And you don't really know how often you use death threats in your humor until they threaten to ban you for it, and you're like, oh shit, I say that all the time, uh-oh. Mm -hmm. A normal ass ravine. We're not gonna be seeing that again anytime soon, boys. Here's the ever present nebulous taiga. By the way, welcome to the jungle. Welcome to the jungle! We got fun and games! That's a, actually a good song. Fun fact my mom used to wake me up for high school to that song. Because it was one that we both liked, and she she always likes to put on exciting music in the morning to wake her up. My mom's my mom's a spin. Don't don't fuck with my mom. She's the coolest lady I've ever met. Admittedly, I've not met many women. <laughs> I don't know if that's true, but my mom's one of the coolest ladies I've ever met for sure. I love her. It's very fun being being her son. I like her. She's still a mom, so you know we don't agree all the time. But I I really do like her. Uh. We must be approaching the border, cause my f frames are getting. Abhorrent. Oh my gosh. 
little bit. Hey. <laughs> he fell asleep with it. Are oh, you snoring? Dude, I love you. Oh, let's sneak away so as not to startle him. He's a. S oh, I did it anyway. He's a snoozy little boy. Oh, that was magical. Ah, uh, this is the weird, this is Big Lake. It's so bad. I, oh, guys, guys. Let's turn down our simulation. To that did nothing. We want low sim distance. Bank. If it's if it really is these vines, it might not be the vines. Oh, guys, I don't think it's the vines. Oh, really not attractive video right now. Wait, is that a new? Oh shit, is it laggy because we're recording? Are we generating? Hold on. But it hangs up for an entire fucking like minute. I mean like a second. A second's pretty big though. I need to turn down the render distance i think it's really smooth except for the hang-ups maybe it doesn't look like that on video maybe you guys are like throwing up right now maybe you're shitting and crying and throwing up right now but for me it's like 60 frames per second except when it isn't This, I think, is new. Well, I don't have arrows. Huh. That's not fair. It's kind of bad. Ugh. Oak. Ugh. Oh, you gotta cram oak into every biome, right? Respect your lifestyle. I just don't want it forced down me and my children's throats. You know what I mean? One of my nightmares is that people are going to think I'm actually conservative. I make jokes like that so often. I can't. I was about to say, I can't believe I don't have any arrows. I barely had any arrows to begin with before I lost all of my items to lava, so. I don't think that's accurate. This render distance has really helped, which is unfortunate, maybe. But also, maybe fortunate. Turn it down more and turn up some other things, alright? That foggy shit. Wow. The Herobrine Forest. Oh my god, guys. Guys, 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 guys. Five is the minimum? Herobrine Forest. Is that our, like, title for this video, maybe? Do you think?
I want to find a batshit crazy little cave. Uh, I think we're in the new gen. If we're not, well, isn't that humiliating? How is it loading so slow on two chunks? I can't fucking believe you just gave me a frame hiccup. How dare you? Guys, Herobrine's forest is dead. It didn't help. This range end kicking my ass. Oh, we something happening to us. I feel like I miss. <laughs> I've missed her here. It tell me the sons have trapped me in the fucking dimension. I'm dying in the 80s. My first. shows me right twenty three eight frames per second. Two one. Help me, God. Help me. A second. Facing north. Oh my god, facing north. Are we going the wrong way? Is more being carded now? Hold this. God damn it. How long was I paused? Why does this keep happening? I keep repausing. I keep pausing and unpausing my recordings, and like one of them doesn't take, and so I end up like opposite of what I think I am. I hope I didn't lose too much footage there. Yeah, like this is really riveting footage. So guys, guess what? 119 is fucking scuffed, okay? It's busted. It's... It's a little bit too wacky for my computer to handle. So for all intents and purposes, we are damned to the chunks that we have already generated. 
we stick to the rivers and streams that we are used to. Wow. How crushing. Well, let's, uh, maybe, uh, maybe we, uh, give that a go. It's a little overwhelming. This is one of the pieces by, I'm so sorry if I get this wrong, I believe her name is Kumi Tanioka. Um, and I also apologize for this, but I can't place the name. It's the first in-game song that we have heard. And I have no clue what this one is. I don't... I don't even remember when it started playing, so I can't even narrow it down by bio. I would have to open YouTube and, like, listen to all the songs and see which one it sounded like. Wow, it's a lot better now that we're back home. Don't go north. There's an unspeakable lag entity that will kill you if you go north, I guess. Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones. Sorry. I want your sacks. Sorry, kings. So you know what I would love? I would love to see a new cave biome right now. Cheer me up. That was awful. I, I was the most excited for the overworld terrain generation, and I'm not going to be able to see it until I get my new computer assembled. Or at least hopefully that'll do it. God, what if I can't just ever? What if Minecraft becomes a game that's too advanced for me to play? What'll happen to my channel, my clicks, my views? All my views come from Minecraft. That's a lie. All my views come from ASMR. But all of my views that come from my friends come from Minecraft. <laughs> By that I mean all, I mean like, you know. I post a Minecraft video on Twitter. I get like thir 13 or like 26, you know, like views. I don't know why it has to be a multiple of 13, but you know what I mean, right? Like, I get a, I get a couple of views on a Minecraft video. If it's not Minecraft, then it's like somewhere between like six and 15 views most times. I don't know. Probably depends on the age of the video. If I had to guess. So what we're going to do is dig. That song was nothing, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't like being negative. That's a lie. I love being negative. But I don't want to be negative about Minecraft music because I actually do think that it adds something to just have like a kind of kind of that's the ugliest sound I've ever heard. I'm cutting that out. I do think that there's something to be said for a song that's just like you know like Woob, a woo 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 s song. So, 
I'm glad it's in the game. Oh, hey. The level formerly known to be that of Bedrock. What's up? What's up? Oh, yeah. Guys, do light changes. Let's check this out. Eight. Oh, well, this one spawn anyway. <laughs> That's going to be a weird adjustment, I think, for me personally, is trying not to be crazy about light levels. I hope I get some intuition regarding that soon. Wow, I hate this. Not the lag spike plea, but L. What if there's not a cave? Wait, 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 wait. Here, hold on, hold on. Shut up. Do you hear that? dripstone this has always been a dripstone dense area and by that I mean well it shows up sometimes more than I can say for a lush cave biome I got some moss from a trader and that's about it tough Everybody. I would like some gold. Am I hold on? God damn it, guys. Look at this. Look at how expertly i've missed this cave all right well it's a good thing i cheated me every time something horribly goes wrong every time something's about to go horribly wrong i'm like well it's a good thing i cheated and then something happens oh 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 but this might this might be a thing look light level five they will not spawn down there i don't even have to i don't even have to light that up Guys, dipstone. <laughs> Shut up, boy. <laughs> Eerily quiet down here. Look at this, look at this. Hold on. Let me turn off smooth lighting for a second. Not because I have to anymore, but because I want you to see this. This light level extends all the way out to here. I believe this block is light level zero. 
Yeah. It extends all the way out here, and this is where mobs will spawn. You didn't have to do that, man. Um, you. You, 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 you. Is this zero? Wish I had a glare to tell me. Sorry guys, I'm never gonna stop being toxic about the glare and the ally and all that shit. I'm sorry. Oh my god! What the fuck? Marina Diamondis? Fuck the lapis trick. We don't need the lapis trick. He says, mining through lapis. I see. I didn't... Didn't unload any of that. Did I? No? Let's uh, put that in the old hand. Oh. Really any good place for diarrhea? That doesn't look bad. Uh, we'll put it there. <laughs> There's lapis. Might be wondering, Brad. Why are you carrying around the rotten flesh? And one the sunflower. Why are you carrying around one flower? Carrying around granite. Eight sticks. Um, I'll invite you to mind your fucking business. Ooh, I can free up a slot. Hop. Yeah, this new like placement for torches, the distance, the intuitive distance is gonna have to be uh, greatly exaggerated. I need to learn to exaggerate that distance because my instinct really wants me to put them close together. We want lapis. We want lapis. We don't want so much lapis that it prevents us from getting diamond, though. And I'm not a fool. Mom didn't raise me like that. So we're going to be investigating and getting a money's worth. For all of this, even the lapis. Even the lapis. All these basic summon us. Even the lapis. You're doing very well. Does he even say that in the game? Does he ever compliment you? It's a bad teacher if he doesn't compliment you when you do well. IMO. What does Baldy do to make sure that students kindle their love for knowledge? What does he do, huh? He beats them. It's not right. Crunch. Granite. That's what we want. It's dead fucking silent in here. <laughs> oh my god. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I keep checking to see if I'm recording because I'm super fucking paranoid about it now. Hey guys. I have a confession to make. Not about the sneezing. Get over that. But I have a confession to make. I... Oh, I'm so mad. I wanted a disc. I wanted a disc. Um.
this isn't good. Great. Um, don't say that. so much stuff on the ground and I can't pick any of it up and I want all of it I just wish that the bundles got included in the game but they didn't and now I'm upset because the bundles didn't get included in the game Is zero durability on it. I kind of want it for the museum. Do we already have a skeleton bow? We have a we have a makeshift cobbled together bow. And guess what? We're about to have. Wait. Minecraft. Why? Why ever would you need to punish someone for wanting to repair their item? Furthermore, fuck ton of dipstone got yassified by that creeper. Don't ask me what the fuck I'm talking about. I don't know. So... I have so much shit I don't need, but I need it. I think we know what time it is, boys and girls. Time for an emergency chest. One that we can put our junkiest junk into and not feel super guilty about it. This is over 16 logs. If we translate this into planks, it'll be over a stack of logs. We don't want that. We want to reduce. Keeping a rot flesh. We're keeping the sweet berries and we're keeping the sunflower and we're keeping the spruce boat. We're keeping the carrots. Fuck y'all. Fuck y'all. We want Flint to go away. Me when I'm Obama. Political joke. That always gets the boys hot and bothered, right? Not in the correct way, though. We got a lot of gold down here. I mean, we're pretty deep. So that makes sense. Especially considering that they're committing to that a lot more. That certain materials have certain depths. Wow, you guys are numerous. <laughs> Music. Why would I want you to do that? Get out of my hand. We have a lot of iron. So I don't know if we need that. Oh, hey. So, whenever pe- Back to what I was saying before that whole dumb inventory debacle happened. Cool, I love when I do that. I have a confession to make about 118. I've been really trying to temper my expectations for this update. 
Everybody loves it, and I'm glad they love it. But I've always been a little skeptical. And that's because A did not trust that it would run well on my computer. We see who was right about that. It was me. It cannot run on my computer well. Another thing though, I think I have unrealistic expectations for what is interesting to explore. I like lore and implied lore and world building, and that's my main motivation for exploration most of the time. But Minecraft doesn't have a lot of that. It has a little bit of that, which I love. I eat it the fuck up. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, 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 yum. But yeah, in general, Games that are randomly generated have a lot of repetition in them. And unfortunately, I am the kind of person that once you've seen it once, you've seen it a million times. Maybe not once, but once you've seen it a couple times, you've seen it a million times. And I'm very, very scared that these new caves will fall under that just as much as the old caves have because I really like this game, and I like enjoying this game. But sometimes my, I don't know, high standards and ADHD team seem to really clash with that. I love that funky little bass line. Diamonds! Y'all are gonna get tired of hearing me say that. I need to remember to light it on the correct side. Dude. Well, that sure didn't help. I like this song. I like all the songs, except a couple of the wooshy ones. <laughs> Bitch boy. At the very least, we got to explore dripstone caverns this episode, guys, right? You're, you're a bitch. So you fall under that umbrella. You fall under that umbrella. Umbrella? You fall under that umbrella as well. As well. -er. aren't huge in quantity, which is good. I was worried they'd be too easy to get, but I also think that they used to be too hard to get, so. I think when it comes to game design, you gotta think long term. You can't let your id control your game design decisions, otherwise you end up like World of Warcraft, which is basically just a Skinner box for people who are crazy. Um, like, I like this. I like this. This cave sucks, and I really enjoy that. This feels like a real cave, and I hate it. All he got's iron back here. <laughs> gonna say I guess we could pick it up but we really can't can we so yeah like I'm saying you can't let your 
can't like quick rewards and like a like a, a fast dopamine hit influence your game design decisions in my opinion because like i said that i think that's how you get games like world of warcraft where it's like you're a rat in a cage and everyone's miserable and toxic um it can't be all about efficiency nor can it all be about random chance and grinding you have to play the long game and what i mean by that is that you really have to focus on the gameplay in between the rewards more than the rewards themselves which i think minecraft arguably has done very well um i will say without re without meaningful rewards that can be a little eh. but i think the rewards shouldn't matter at all like i don't think Maybe not at all, but, uh, the journey has to be just as much of a reward as the reward itself, I think is what I'm trying to say, and I'm really not expressing that too clearly. In fact, I'm expressing it quite shitly. Um... So what happens in Minecraft is that you go on this whole fucking journey and then you get to the end of it and it's like, oh, it's like, oh, I've spent eight hours getting one diamond, you know? <laughs> um, I don't think that really happens much in 1.18, probably, because, I mean, like, look at me. We've already got diamonds. It's been, like, an hour. Most of that was not in these caves. You're a cock. You're a motherfucker. I love the lapis. Give me the lapis. I love the lapis. We're running out of torches, so soon we'll have to head back. Ooh. Um. I really don't know where I'm going with this. I think my point is that I really enjoy the idea of exploring for little rewards that are more consistent over a, you know, quote unquote, big reward obtained after hours of grinding. Because often big rewards don't feel that big to me because the frustration of getting there was so much work that I can no longer be excited about the big reward, quote, quote. Um, and I think originally when diamonds were extremely hard to find back in the old old days and back in the uh which might have been perceived maybe it's easy i haven't played alpha for a while but in like 117.0 for example they were too hard to find nobody was pleased with that and i'm really glad that they went for what they seem to be doing in 118 now. One arrow. Oh, oh, they're all dead. Oh! That's fine. Where are we? Put all this shit. Alright, I guess that's kind of pretty. What am I doing? I should be getting all this, shouldn't I? Maybe not necessarily the blocks, but. Can you break this with your hand? Weird, you can. Like, I don't know. Things being difficult should be 
skill based. In my opinion, not due to chance, which is what diamond hunting is. It's all chance. It just depends on where it generates and where you find it. There's no strategy right now. And I think Mojang resents that. I, according to like what they've been saying about their plans for the game, they, they really want to add strategy to mining. That's a thing they keep repeating. And I really like that because that's something that will make the game much better and will increase its longevity for people like me. Um, which is something that I really value, obviously, because I'm a people like me. So yeah, that's my gameplay design philosophy. I'm, I'm, I'm real good at philosophizing, but if you ask me to code something, I'll be a, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be toast. That'll be it for me. I want you to look at me and I want you to kill me. Was it one piece of gravel? I don't want that. I don't want it. Nice. They got gravity. I was gonna say check this out and have it fall on me, but I think it might kill me actually. I could do something like that. See, hit me, hurt me. So yeah, for all at this point to drip stuff. This stuff's good. This stuff's good for. Uh... Okay. Well. It's about time to start heading back. By that I mean it is time. We're out of. I hate you with my life. Time to start heading back. Time to start heading back. Ah, oh, you're so many. was around when you tried to hurt me. Skeleton. Oh, you're awful. You're awful. You're the worst. Is it better than a spider eye? Yeah. But then, I already have a bunch of dripstone blocks. I like when I fall and I die. This one again, huh? I can see how the biome dependent music might get ripped competitive for certain biomes.
we're gonna have to where is it I was gonna say we're gonna have to be proactive about this one but I don't think we will I think we should just leave cool Forty-four. Okay. Okay. Why doesn't it repeat this often in the nether biomes, right? Above the nether. Boyfriend just texted me, uh, that's me, I'm the rat. <laughs> I must have sent an image earlier or something. Dangerous biome, folks. That's five co cobbled deep slate. We don't want that. All right. Um, what do we want to bring? Gunpowder. Um. really chugging through this food. No, we want to keep the apples. I keep keep putting them in a spot that we don't want them. We have cobblestone, right? Ah. There is one problem, and that's the problem of put the spider eye in there, and I'll take the bow. I value, I value the science, the history, over any wealth or resources, and y'all know that I have made some questionable decisions this playthrough. anything. Doesn't matter. I don't think I want the bow on my bar. It's the thing. I think we want the water bucket close at hand, though. Oh, back in familiar territory, am I right? That felt like I was spelunking in, like, terra firma craft or something. I will say, that's like actually really cool. Um, I really want those big caves. That, that was a big cave. But you know what I mean, right? Like, I want those like fucking gargantuan caves. Like, really, what I'm envisioning is one of those lush caves that like carves open the side of a mountain. annoying haunch placement that I've ever had. Um, we should put all of our 
that in there, I think. Um, I want to go back down, actually. I want to go back down. I don't want that chest to be down there. Well, I want it to be down there. But I want to get the items that are in it, and I want to move it a little. So we're going back. Yay. What are we looking at here for time? Oh, this one's going to be a chore to edit already. Um, cool. <laughs> Luckily, the drunk episode's like 40 minutes, which is awesome. I love that. Can't really sprint in this biome. Still on the fence about the dripstone caves biome. I think it's cool. Idea wise, I think it's cool. You don't have to do this. Every time I jump on a spike, it hurts me. Why doesn't it hurt you? <sighs> I'm eating me out of house and home right now. If only I had one extra inventory space, this wouldn't take multiple trips. I want to put the chest near the entrance. Furthermore, I want to make sure the entrance is like a little bit safer. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little path here. We don't have torches, really, but that's fine. Tink tink, bitch. I think we do maybe want to use spoose planks. And you see what I said about it being more than a stack now, right? Um, I think we'll want that here, more like. And then it's like, I don't, really, I don't really know if we want, you know, too much dipstone in the way. But that, I mean, what if we just dug there? Right? What if we just dug there? What if we dig dug? Oh, we dig dug. We we dig dug. We we dig dug was a merry old slug. Merry old slug was he. We get some tough. We'll get some tough. Um, not, we don't really need all this, do we? Um, I guess some tough. We'll make a nice little room for ourselves down here. It'll be a forward base for the dipstone caves. It's really hard to drop the like j sound 
in dripstone because I keep I like dropping letters from things to make them funnier but the thing is if I kept the j and like dropped the r it would become a little bit slurry so I don't want anything that I do to be able like to be described as a little bit slurry Um, so we could make a little, we could make a doorway here or something. We're going to put that there. Just a second. Can't trust nobody, not even yourself. Okay. What we're actually going to do, I think, that might be button is like what's in here you know oh this could actually be a pretty good passageway i don't think i want to block that off we want you for the salvation army they don't recruit like that and you know what good fuck the salvation army right here first folks fuck the Salvation Army. I knew you'd shoot that way. Me when my gun apprentice is disappointing. I knew you'd shoot that way. Okay, so let's go get the, uh, brain? Let's go get the crafting bench. Don't worry, it's, it's a very good idea for me to be down here without torches. If you gave me the shovel, that would have been hugely stressful, actually. That would have been an artifact that we had to babysit forever. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, thank God. Okay, we had a food we could eat. Infrastructure, boys, that's what it's all about. These should be swapped. They're so choosy about when they want to be picked up. All right. What do we want to leave in here, do you think? anything or do we bring it up to our forward forward operating base or is this the forward forward okay we got the forward operating base up here and that one down there is the fast forward <laughs> operating base all right let's let's That's no longer accurate. This is a thrilling episode. <laughs> um, Oh, guys, we forgot our other forward operating base. Well, shit. Um, I'm 
gonna open that up so I don't forget it anymore. It's actually kind of nice looking. Anyway. I might start playing with smooth lighting off. The hard lines make it really easy to see when it's spawnable. Especially now that it's not some arbitrary number and it's literally like, you can tell. Um. Yes. Yeah, so, um. Let me scoot my chair in a little. My back's really bad because I always try to hunch so that I don't hit the mic with my movements and it just hurts so bad every time. Everything in me right now looks like something I wanna bring to the surface. So what out of this do I wanna bring to the surface? These, very much so. Um, thinking the flint. Pointed dripstone. I already have a stack, so spider eye gunpowder. Well, we are not brewing potions anytime soon, folks. Not trading with villagers anytime soon, but I don't want to come down here for it again. It's the thing. Ah. <sighs> But it's fucking rot flesh. All right, well, that's that. Back to the surface. Man, the YouTube chapters on this are gonna be a pain. We're all over the place today. And by that, I mean, we're doing largely the same thing for the whole episode, except for that first half, woof. But it's just, who knows what I've been doing for the past 30 minutes. I always go the wrong way. I never go the wrong way, actually. I've only gone the wrong way like once, and now it's twice. So it feels like I always go the wrong way. Follow the, follow the crafting tables. That's what we always, it's what they taught me in Explorer's Academy. Now that we're back on the surface again, the frames are considerable. Not bad yet, but considerable. I like the idea of the sheep making the zombie noises. Biome blending looking good. It's interesting that that's a graphic setting that you can turn on. Check it out. Check it out. Look at this. Weird, right? If we're looking at biomes, and that's on the left, I believe. It isn't. Hey, good news, guys. I got my lefts and rights confused because I'm a kindergartner. It is on the left. It's in the middle of that big chunk. Right now it says we're in Minecraft River, Minecraft Swamp. Minecraft Swamp, what's the difference? What's the difference between mossy green and dark green swamp? Hmm. Well. What if 
we did this. Oh, it's seamless. Oh, it's C nanners. We don't need it to be that high. Normal is fine by me. Hello. Well, I hope one of you was the horny boy from earlier, because otherwise... You're gonna have to wait till next episode, bub. Oh, finally, we're back home. We can do the exciting task of inventory management, my favorite one. Um, so we want to put all of our farm things there. My farm things, I mean plants. We can farm pointed dripstone, but first of all, I don't really see a need now that we have the caves to farm it for us. Um, and second of all, even if we did, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. How about that smoker? What's a smoker take these days? It definitely requires logs, doesn't it? You know, I could have saved my first diamond. That probably would have been a cute thing for the museum. Guys, I need to do some inventory management. What do you think? Is next episode the inventory management extravaganza? Or are we going to make a sorting system or something? A storage room, maybe? Good enough. So we're going to yomp up here, and anything that's in the chest, we'll put in it, but anything that doesn't fit in the chest, well, we will deal with that. For instance, Lapis Lazuli does not fit. A little of that, maybe. Gunpowder fits. Good, good. Four cobblestone. Give me that. I want it. I want it in my hands. Um. Their riches, or building blocks, or fucking bone. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we ha already had glowing six. Cool. That'll be good for our forward base. Two and a six. Yeah, this shit's a mess. Okay, folks. Let's go out to the ruins and we can sign off. Kind of become our official sign off place, huh? Like, I like never end the episode in the house anymore. Alright, 
minutes. So I can never control myself when I'm in F5 mode. So we've discovered the horrors of technological advancements. Um, we cannot leave our circle. We've learned that now. It's unfortunate, but it has to be that way. We've explored a new cave biome, which was exciting. Well, maybe not exciting, but it was, it was novel. It was fun. I really enjoyed it. And we've wasted a lot of time in between. So I hope you enjoyed, and I hope next time you will join me for even more time-wasting and fun. Bye!